In today's video, I'm opening up an entire case of the new set Wild Survivors for the Hungry Burger. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video opening new product, which is the brand new Wild Survivors. You can't even see it because it's so high. These, uh, these nice uh, little stacks I got here. Wild Survivors does contain the collector rare Hungry Burger. And that is what we will be searching for starting today. And tomorrow we will have a live stream opening until we pull the collector rare Hungry Burger because we may or may not pull it here, but either way, we're gonna do another live stream tomorrow. So it's gonna be pretty epic. But before we get started, we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away a booster box of the new Wild Survivor set. Just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below. Will we pull the Hungry Burger in this video? If not, then I guess we're gonna pull it tomorrow. This video is sponsored by YouTube's. YouTube's has released hundreds of unique collectibles and plushies like creator and friend of the channel, Jarvis Johnson. To TV shows, animes, and games like Avatar, Breaking Bad, SpongeBob, and Call of Duty. U2's releases are limited edition. Every figure is made from a new design, and once a U2 sells out, it is gone forever, never to be released again. U2's recently collabed with Yu-Gi-Oh! to bring their characters to life. Somehow U2's found out that I liked Yu-Gi-Oh! Not sure where you guys found that, but that's pretty impressive. And they sent me this awesome Kaiba figure. It comes in pretty awesome packaging, as you guys can see. I mean, it's got some really cool designs on the back. It's got the three blue eyes, white dragons, three of the four to ever exist in the world. They're not only going to have Seto Kaiba, but they're also going to have the blue eyes, white dragon, dark magician girl and dark magician available on U2s.com. And when you buy the blue eyes, white dragon, dark magician girl and dark magician, one out of six of these U2s will come in a ghost variant. This is a perfect little collection to get into U2s, especially if you like Yu-Gi-Oh. So head over to U2s.com and grab your Yu-Gi-Oh collection today. Thanks again to U2s for sponsoring this video. All right, let's get started, guys. 288 packs to be open today. We're not going to do a pack trick because we'll do a Ruxin special, though, that's for sure, because this is going to be a long video. So sit back, relax, grab your popcorn. Man, I... <laughs> I gotta stop. I'm going right to it every time. So I'm officially two for two on Rux and Specials. Um, yeah, maybe we'll have a Rux and Special counter. That'll be fun. I'm gonna do it like this. Okay, yeah, actually, you know what? We won't because I'm gonna do it sideways. That'll help me not Rux and Special, if you guys know what I'm saying. It's a little bit easier not to Rux and Special when you open it uh, side to side like this. So there's a super rare. Vanguard Souls Pluton. This is the first day it's available on TCG Player, so the prices are probably a little bit more normal today. On the video, of course, we had to edit it yesterday, so it's probably still not that accurate. We're going to see if we can make our money back in this opening. So there will be a counter on the screen for what our value is. This is going to be probably pre-sale prices because we don't edit them, you know, same day as release, obviously, especially these longer videos. So I'm assuming that uh oh, we got something vanquish soul heavy burger, not a burger, a burger. So we got a burger, not a burger. We need to pull a burger, not the burger. Yeah, keep that in mind, guys. No burger. We want the burger, even though honestly, I think that uh, anything vanquish souls is pretty solid. So I mean, <laughs> we're not complaining about getting it, but the burger is what we're really looking for. OK, guys, we have Bank of Souls, uh, the Burger Collector Rare, not the Burger Super. I mean, I do want to pull the Burger Super. I will be setting those aside. I will probably have some of those, uh, you know, save for the future because Burger is just amazing, you know? Not because they're going to be expensive, the Super Rares at least, uh, just because they're really cool. We have a Transcendent Meteoris. Gonna be a long, long video today. I know a lot of you guys like these because they turn into like sort of a podcast kind of thing. I just start talking, you know? And speaking of talking, you know what there is to talk about? 200K subscribers. I don't know where we're at exactly right now, but we're very close. So if you guys want to subscribe to the channel, it would be fantastic. You also, of course, can enter the giveaway by doing that and uh, commenting and stuff like that. But I would love to hit 200K. Like we're aiming for next week. That'd be really cool because we have the Invasion of Chaos First Edition box opening coming up. So there's that. The 200 pack for 200K, I think will be maybe even better than the Invasion of Chaos. It's gonna be an insane opening. I've got some really good stuff lined up. Also, we pulled one Ultra Rare so far. <laughs> Hungry Burger, let's go, the burger. I think that burger actually looks really nice and super rare. It hits pretty well. Wild Survivors, bless us with some crazy pulls. We got another burger, that's back to back, baby. Let's go. I'm excited about the live stream tomorrow as well because it's always fun to do those brand new live streams, especially when we can do them, you know, like a Saturday and stuff, it's really fun. Okay, and we haven't done one where we went, well, I guess, did we do that for the Gate Guardian? I guess we did, uh, but we didn't have to open that much. Sometimes with Collector Rare sets, it can be a fast pull, but if you guys remember, uh, <laughs> there was the Collector Rare set called the Scapegoat, where it didn't go so well. We had seven cases to open. Uh-oh, 
Oh, Vanquish Soul Dr. Mad Love. We pulled this in Collector Rare recently. Go check out that video if you guys want to enter that giveaway because uh, it was part of the giveaway. All right, Wild Survivors, let's go. It's been epic so far. We've had a lot of great pulls, but the pull we are searching for has not yet happened. The Collector Rare Hungry Burger. Let's go, we have, okay. Nice super rare right there. Okay, uh-oh, we knocking packs off. Maybe that means something, does it? Is it a sign? Come on. Oh, it was a sign. Stake your soul. Okay, very cool. What is this, Vanquish Soul? Of course, there's so many Vanquish Soul Ultras. Are they like all Ultra Rares? I mean, obviously there's some Supers and stuff, but I feel like there's hardly any Ultras for the other archetypes like Dino and the Burger. But almost everything seems to be a Vanquish Soul. Banker Soul, super rare. I'm gonna pull those aside as well because a lot of the supers are like two and three dollars, which is like insane for a super rare. We have Lost World, Meteor is super rare right there. Amador and Arcosaur. Remember when that was like a $70 secret rare out of Edco? Yeah, if you're old, you remember that. I mean, it's not that old. It was like two and a half years ago, but still. Can you believe it's been two and a half years, guys, since Edco? That's unreal. That is insane to think about that it's that old. Wild Survivors, my pile on the left is kind of wanting to fall over. Let's not let that happen. We got something. We have a fall. Okay, today's menu. Let's just call it that. Anytime it's a burger card, they got some crazy names on there. I'm not going to be able to pronounce them. Let's be honest. Hungry Burger. I can pronounce that guy. That's pretty insane. Wild Survivors. Here we go. Let's do this. Let's pull something good. Vanquish Soul Dust Devil. Another Vanquish Soul card. Survivor of Wild. Here we go. Will we pull something crazy? Another super rare. Nice. Awesome stuff. Seems like you guys liked the uh, the vlog the other day from the last YCS that I went to. Uh-oh. Rock of the Vanquisher. And see, there's so many Vanquish cards. They're literally all the ultras are the uh, Vanquish Soul cards. It's insane. But yeah, it seems like you guys like that. Uh, that vlog, we did a lot more opening in this vlog, which I think is probably why you guys liked it more, but it was pretty fun. I enjoyed it. I'm also going next week to Card Party, which is like a Pokemon event, but I'm hopefully going to see some cool people that like Yu-Gi-Oh as well. So if you are going to that, you're a Pokemon fan, you're just going to happen to be there. Make sure to come say hi to me because, you know, I'm going to be the, the Yu-Gi-Oh guy, you know, I'm going to be the, the lone wolf out there representing the Yu-Gi-Oh community. Maybe I'll get some Pokemon fans to open up Yu-Gi-Oh. Try and get them, you know, convert them over, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Should be fun, though. I think it's going to be a really fun event. It looks like it's well organized by Deep Pocket Monster. Um, there's a lot of people coming, so it should be pretty awesome. It's in L.A., so it's kind of a long flight for me. You know, sometimes I dread going to L.A. because, you know, that cross-country flight. Then you got that time change, but I think it'll be fun. I think it'll be good. Probably be worth it when we get there. I mean, there's a lot of, I think Jarvis is going to be there. Pokerev. You know, and then, of course, a lot more Pokemon people, but very cool stuff. So it should be fun. I'm excited about that. It's coming up next week, like next weekend, I think. So I'll have a vlog for that probably as well. Uh, not going to be as much Yu-Gi-Oh, so we'll see. Like, because I did, I, I was going to vlog like when I went to the Leonhardt event and I just ended up not doing it. So maybe I, I'll try, I'll at least record it, you know, so it's an option. We have Ground Zeno. There's our first non-Vanquish Soul Ultra Rare. Dinos, baby. Do they even have another one? Who knows? But the only ones I pull are Vanquish Soul Ultras. That's... That's what it seems like. Super rare right there. Okay, still a lot of packs to be opened in this video. Let me know down below. Do you like these case openings? You know, do you like doing a case opening on a video and then going into like the multiple case openings on the live stream? You'll have to let me know down below, guys, because I liked your feedback to know what you guys want to see. What else would you like to see from new sets? Do you want to see more new openings? Like maybe like different kind of styles of new openings. Like we do versus battles. You know, we did one yesterday. I don't know. I'm trying to think of some other way we could open new cards in a different way. You know what I mean? So that it's not, you know, the same, you know, the same thing every single time. Because I like for you guys to get to see the new stuff. And I like to do it in more of a fun way if I can think of anything. And I'm kind of stuck on these ideas that I've been doing. So I'm trying to think of something different for that. If you have an idea, make sure to let me know down below. Let's see what else we can get out of Wild Survivors. More super rares right there. No collector rares so far. There is a little bit of a, a rumor I saw going around that they are missing collector rares. I don't know if that's actually true or not. Hopefully not, because you know we would be the ones to get the no collector rare cases. That's just what happened to us at uh, whatever that other set was called, Grand Creators. So that was, oh, that was really sad. So I hope that doesn't happen. I'm not trying to get scammed again. Come on. We have a uh, super rare, not invite scammed. I mean, it's not actually a scam. It's just a uh, mispackaging error or whatever. We have uh, stake your soul, another ultra rare. Okay, still no collector rare. Should be three to four in this case. That's usually the normal ratio. But so far we have a grand total of zero. Zero of them. We have a super rare right there. Can we get something that's a super rare right there? More supers. There's just so many supers in collector rare sets. 
It's what I don't love about them. You just pull a ton of super rares and not really anything you really want. Whoa. Oh, Vanquish Soul Raisin. Another Vanquish Soul. They have to have like all the ultra rares. All right, I just double checked. They have six of the 10 ultra rares. So 60% of the ultra rares are on one of the three archetypes. That's pretty insane. I don't know why they're, it seems like way too many. All right, Wild Survivors, you can do this. You gotta believe. You can pull us a collector rare. Come on, that's a super rare. That is not even close to a collector rare. You didn't even give us an ultra. I mean, come on. Wild Survivors, I'm talking to you. You gotta step it up. That's another super. More burger stuff. We need that home. Hungry Burger, one of the most epic collector rares to ever be released. The Hungry Burger collector rare print. I mean, come on. Classic throwback card. I mean, it's too good. Uh oh. Another Vanquish Souls. We got Dr. Mad Love again. So, wow, there's just too many Vanquish Soul Ultras. Like, making that deck's gonna be a pain. When they're all Ultra Rares, it's gonna be expensive. Hungry Burger, nice. Okay, well, you can actually see the top of the packs now. So, we're making some progress. Hopefully, your popcorn is tasting really good right now, guys, because I know a lot of you guys are eating popcorn, sitting back, your feet are up, relaxing enjoying the video there's a hungry burger and now you're really enjoying it maybe you're enjoying a burger yourself comment down below if you're watching this video eating a burger because if you are hungry burger might be a little bit angry about that i'm just saying but it could be happening i mean there's gonna be you know a decent amount of people watching this so a lot there's a good chance if you're watching this at lunch you're eating a burger right i could really go for a burger right now i'm hungry i'm really hungry now that i think about it okay we gotta we gotta get through these packs. I gotta eat something. We got <laughs> Pantera, nice ultra rare. Very nice, okay. Vanquish Soul Pantera, ultra rare. Another Vanquish Soul, who would have thought? I mean, they're good cards though, so I'm not gonna complain about that. The question is which will be the most expensive because they're not, I mean, even if the deck's expensive or really good, they're not all gonna be like crazy money. Some are gonna be like more than others, obviously. I wanna pull the uh, the Burger Field spell because that's the one that like people have been listing for like crazy money, but like, I think it's the one of like two ultras, maybe even maybe even only one. No, maybe three, because I think Dino might only have one ultra. Come on, let's survive the wild and pull something crazier. Uh oh, uh oh, uh -oh. another bang with soul. <laughs> Heavy burger, another burger before we get the burger. <laughs> okay, here we go. We have bang with soul. That is a does devil. Very cool. Wild Survivors, can you bless us with something crazy? Something super awesome? Let's see if we can pull the burger, because so far, no luck. Here we go, super rare. By the way, if you guys are interested in any of this product, I do have pre-sales available, and at this point, you know, current sales, Sassiato's link down below. So go check it out. The King Sassiato, who's sponsoring the 200K video, by the way. Go check out his links for Wild Survivors. We obviously have the 25th anniversary boxes available as well. So if you guys are interested in that, go check it out in the links in the description. All right, Wild Survivors, here we go. Let's see what we can do. We have Giant Rex. We have a super rare right there. Looking good. Let's see what else we can get. Wild Survivor, super rare, very cool. Can we get a collector rare? Because it's been a lot of packs, I'm not gonna lie. And we have not pulled a collector rare, which is making me a little bit worried because uh, yeah, you guys remember what happened with some collector rare sets in the past. They tend to be the ones to be like missing stuff. Like you doesn't usually, I guess it's easier to tell when you, because like a Starlight set, you wouldn't really know because it's not every case. So maybe that's why, but collector rares, it's really obvious when you get zero in a case that that is not right and not how it's supposed to be. Okay, Frostosaurus, we've got a super rare. Super, 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 super Frostosaurus. Okay, more supers. Where are the collector rares, everyone? I'm getting nervous because, you know, it has happened before and I don't put it past Konami to have maybe sent out collector rare boxes without collector rares in them. I'm hoping that they did send out collector rare boxes with collector rares in them, but uh, once we pull one, I'll feel a little bit better. All right, Manju with his 50th reprint in the last year. Like, I don't even understand why he's getting so many reprints. I get, well, okay, in this set, it makes a little bit of sense because there are other like rituals, like the burger, of course, but like, do you really need another Manju like print? There's a million of them. But I guess that's like, these are called what? Deck building sets. So you kind of got to have that. It helps out. So I guess that's why they did it. I don't know why they printed it so many times beforehand though. It's kind of weird, but oh well. Let's see what we can get. More supers. Wow, this is just... Collector rare mass openings is just like super, 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 super. And then eventually you might get some. The good thing is you more frequently get the high-end cards, like collector rares are one in every three boxes versus starlights are a lot less than that. So I guess that sort of balances it in a way. But in terms of like, just like the base pulls, uh-oh, Vanquish Soul Raisin, that's another ultra rare. Not raisin like, you know, in a cookie or anything. <laughs> different raisin, different raisin. Let's see, Evil Zor. 
Another super. We have not pulled any collector rares. I'm just saying, uh, maybe it'll happen soon. Maybe we'll get hot and pull a few collector rares in a row, maybe. All four of them straight, four straight packs. That'd be pretty crazy. Then I'd start thinking error box if that happened. We have a Vanquish Soul. Heavy Burger, the burger is back. So we're pulling three burgers, no burger. I mean, we pulled some burger, but they've been super burger. We want them collector rare burgers. Another super right there. Can we get something nice? Let's go. Double Evo, we got Vanquish Soul, looking good. Wild Survivors, can you survive a case with no collector rares? Let's find out. That's me talking to myself right there because I'm the one who's gonna have to survive a no collector rare case, which would be pretty rough, very nice. All right, next on Survivor, will we pull a collector rare? Let's go, let's pull something crazy. Hungry Burger, that's pretty crazy, I'll give it to him, Hungry Burger. Let's go. You gotta believe, another super. No collector rare so far. We're a lot of packs in at the moment. The uh, make your money back counter is not gonna look good with no collector rares. It's gonna look pretty bad. Even with the pre-sale prices, it is gonna be a lot harder. <sighs> come on, come on, come on, burger. Come on, burger. That's not a burger. Not a burger at all. No, no. You gotta believe. It's a super. I'm believing and it is not happening, guys. Not like this. Maybe this is gonna like bless us for our 200k stream. Ah, oh, we got one! The Borger Collector Rare! So the Borger Collector Rare comes before the Burger Collector Rare. Hey, we'll take it! Let's go! Collector Rares are in this case. Let's go! Huge pull, Vanquish Shoals, Heavy Burger. That's hilarious that we pulled the Burger before the Burger. That's just really funny. All right, Heavy Burger, very nice. Well done, way to be pulled. We got Vanquish Souls again. Feeling a little bit better about this now, now that we got the Heavy Burger. We got Frostosaurus, we got a Super there. Wow, Survivor, surviving the wild, let's go. Vanquish Souls, we got the Super Rare right there. Will we pull that burger? We got the heavy burger. We need the hungry burger. Almost the exact same name, but not even close to the same thing. Here we go. Super rare. One collector rare down. Let's pull three more. If we pull four, that's the ratio. Normally, some as you get three. Four would be a lot better. We have a Rock of the Vanquisher. That's a nice ultra rare. Little vanquishing action. That is a Link 1 for the Vanquish. Link 1s are usually pretty important to decks, so... That's a big one. All right, packs are appearing to get lower. Are appearing, we're only 20 minutes in on the recording, but uh, there's a lot more packs, so I'm still gonna be over at least 30 minutes. Probably 40 plus minutes is what these usually go, you know, end up being. So, they're pretty fun long videos. Hopefully you guys like these. I enjoy doing these a little bit, you know, uh, not a little bit. <laughs> I enjoy doing these sometimes is what I meant to say. It sounded like I kind of enjoy it, not really. But I like doing it uh, every once in a while, just, you know, get the new set, get a feel for it. And then I can kind of like go into the live stream having a little bit more experience opening it, which is fun. And then, of course, when there's something I really want to pull, like the burger, not the burger, then uh, I can get hyped. We have a super right there. Give us some dino collector rares, like UTC or whatchamacallit. I just forgot the name of the searcher. I just forgot for some reason. Uh, we'll see it soon. It's just, a, it's just a rare in here, I think. Where is it? Come on, Dino, show yourself. Solding over after that one. Yeah, that'd be cool as well. Okay, we have Vanquish. We have Enidor and Arctosaur. I haven't even looked at all the CRs. Fire Formation 10 key? Oh, we're definitely gonna pull that now. I hope we do. We don't get that. That's super lame. The Meteorus is a collector rare. UTC, Heavy Hungry Burger. Oh, Enidor and Arctosaur is one. That's cool. Okay, Vanquish Soul. That makes sense. I was surprised that that wasn't, but it is, so I wasn't right about that. Survive in the Wild, let's go. We have a Super right there. Next up, another Wild Survivors. One Collector Rare so far. Can we get a second one soon, or will we get one at all? I mean, Econ's in here. That I could have seen as being like a staple that they Collector Rare. We have a Stake Your Soul. I think that also might be a Collector Rare. The thing about Collector Rare sets is there are so many Collector Rares. There's 15 of them. So like, you're like, almost any card could be a Collector Rare. I have no idea. And a Medoran Archosaur added again. Very, very nice. Come on, get out of here. Let's go. We have a Vanquish Soul Trap. Good stuff. Wild Survivors. Give us that burger. Burger us up. Vanquish Soul, Dr. Mad Love. Another one of those. We have like three of those, I think, so far. Plus a pull to Collector Rare. In another video, we have a, oh, I saw the spell and I was like, maybe we got today's menu. That's a good one. That is a good card. Nice spell card, Ultra. Can we, have we pulled the, I don't think we've pulled, I just threw the super rare. I don't think we've pulled the, isn't it like a field spell for the Hungry Burger? I feel like it's a field spell. I don't know. I don't think we've pulled it yet. We pulled today's menu, but we have not pulled the other one. Come on, survivors. Bless us. 
Something crazy, another Vanquish Soul, cool. Where is no dino stuff either? Where are the dinos? Come on, give us more dinos, especially collector rares. That's what we really want. Amador and Arcosaur, give us the Soul Eating Over after the UTC. Any of those would be sick, to be honest. Still a lot of packs to go. I mean, we're probably at like three or four or five boxes left. I don't even know how to tell because like we're kind of going all the way across. Hungry Burger, super rare. That's a big plus. We always want to see that. Frostosaurus, we got Vanquish Souls. There can only be one. That has to be a collector rare, right? Gotta be. I, I don't know if it is or not. We have Rock of the Vanquisher, another ultra rare. The Rock of Vanquisher. Here we go. Where is the collector rares? Where are the collector rares, I should say correctly? Will we pull it? We have Xeno. That is one that is a collector rare. That's probably actually a pretty cool looking one. It's pretty nice looking super, so I can see that being nice. Let's see, we have a, another super, super rare, making it happen. Wild Survivors, come on, come on. Bless us with something crazy. I feel like it's a little bit slow here. Where's our collector rare at? Come on, come on, come on. Bless us, bless us, bless us. Nope, not that time. That's the meat recipe. Just the meat. Just the meat recipe. We have a giant Rex. The Rex is giant. Wild Survivors. Uh oh, I flipped a pack over. Maybe that's a sign. Last time we did something like that, it was a sign. Let's see. Here's the flipped over pack. Maybe I was calling my shot without even knowing. Let's go. We have a... No, didn't work. Did not work. Still many packs to go <sighs> of this Wild Survivors opening. Where are the collector? We have one collector rare right now. I'm nervous. I mean, you would think that means there's more because we've already pulled one. There's still a lot of packs left, but I still worry. It's like maybe they only put like one collector rare per case sometimes or, you know, you never really know until you get to your ratio because it just it is still random somewhat in boxes. It's more consistent, but sometimes you get some craziness happening cases and that's what I'm nervous about. We don't I mean, we want good craziness, not bad craziness because I have had some, both, and bad is a lot worse, obviously. We have Vanquisher, Heavy Borger, of course. The Borger is our favorite card, apparently. We keep pulling that guy. All right, Heavy Borger, you've been nice, but we're really looking for a Collector Rare. Not you again, because we've already pulled you. So let's pull like a, you know, Collector Rare. Hungry Burger, I should say. I was about to say Heavy Burger. Heavy Burger and Hungry Borger. <laughs> Just flip them around. It should be fine. We have a another that's those are the hungry burger cards right the noivelis noivelis i think they are there's a lot of rituals which makes sense because hungry burgers are ritual still many packs to go many packs left until we pull the epicness of the burger we have okay i mean or until we don't pull the epicness of the burger which is probably more likely come on stake your soul okay steak i wish they i wish that was a hungry burger card and it was spelled s-t-e-a-k that would have been cool but instead it's you know stake your soul and vanquish they should have had two different ones like one was for the burger one was for a different archetype that would have been hilarious they just have another card called stake your soul but it's a different archetype for the burger that'd be hilarious i would have been in on that that would have been so good here we go super 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 rares add it again collector rares would you like to show up would you like to appear at the party would you like to uh you know maybe be on the boat to battle city with us i mean uh i mean duel's kingdom i should say different spot Okay, or they are on the blimp to bat the end of Battle City. Maybe that. We will fight on my blimp and someone will almost fall off and die. <laughs> that was the craziest part when people were about to fall off the blimp at, in like the middle of the night. You guys remember that in uh, Battle City or like kind of Battle City? It's like where they took that break and went to uh, the Noah virtual world. And then they came back and like, I don't remember how it happened, but somehow somebody almost got knocked off of the, <laughs> the blimp. It was insane. All right, wild survivors, baby. Come on. Give us those collector rares. Where are you? Anybody home? Collector rares? Wild survivors, can I knock on your door? Hello, anybody there? You got any cards that we can pull potentially maybe? I don't know. Come on, uh-oh. Giant Rex, uh-oh, we got some. Oh, it's a Caesar Valius. That is an ultra. That is not a collector rare. Not great, not great so far. Fire formation, that's a super rare right there. Burger, we want you to appear to us. Come on, Burger. Come on, Burger. Why are you like this, Burger? Why? Why are you like this? You are not appearing to us, Collector Rares. I think Burger, like, is in a committee with the Collector Rares. Like, yeah, he's not pulling us today. Not happening. But Burger, like, rebelled because he's like, you trying to be me. You're the Burger. I'm the Burger, the OG. And he's like, no, I'm the Burger. Yeah, so I think that's what happened. Probably Hungry Burger, super rare. 
Okay, he heard us talking about him, I guess. A lot of packs left, guys. A lot of packs left. Nothing to worry about. Plenty of time, right? I'm not worried. You shouldn't be worried, as Woody would say. All right, what would Woody say here? Woody would be like, don't worry, guys. It's just a, it's just a trading card. You know, he's not a, I'm not a toy. Okay, Wild Survivors, you have been interesting so far let's to say the least uh been searching for your you know good pulls we have had one collector rare so far which is not great we have a oh there it is the restaurant at table our first one so this is the one people were listing for like a thousand bucks we finally pulled this one so it took us that long to get one so i'm assuming they don't short print ultras and collector rare sets but there's really no reason to assume that because they'll probably do whatever you know I mean, I don't know. I guess the card's crazy, maybe. I'm not really sure. Hungry Burger, nice. Wild Survivors, can you bless us with a collector right now? Okay, super. That was the, not the Ultra was listed for 1,000. That was the collector version of that, so... Yeah, not that ultra. That would be a little... I mean, obviously, a 1,000's crazy anyway, but it was the collector rare version that they were putting that high. There's only a couple of vendors. That's why you can't really count on the old uh, pre-sale prices. Like, you know, sometimes they're good. Sometimes they're not very good. They're just like people memeing or whatever. Okay, Giant Rex, we have another ball grill. Golly, there is not that many packs left with what we started. We probably opened like two thirds of them. We have one of the four potential collector rares that we should probably get. I am nervous. I am officially nervous, everybody. I mean, I've been nervous, but that now it's getting worse. It's getting like, whoa, we might actually get one collector rare, which would be really rough for And that'll mean like, it's probably gonna be really hard to pull the burger if we get one collector rare per case, because there's 15 of them. That would be a 15 case average we would need to open. And uh, yeah, I don't have 15 cases at the moment. I'm not gonna lie. I wish I did, it'd be great, but I don't, it's too expensive. We have super rare right there. Good old supers, come on, wild survivors. Let's go, bless us with some epicness. Here we go, evil Zor. Got a super right there. Very cool. Ah, where are you? Where are you, Christmas? Why can't I find you? There we go! An Animador Narcosaur Dinosaur Collector Rare! That is what I'm talking about. That centering is terrible. Look at that. Look how, like, pushed over it is. There's a giant border on the right side. Amador and Argus are beautiful collector rare though. Look at that pattern in the back. That might be one of the best looking collector rares for an NA print I've ever seen because Euros usually look a little bit better. Wow, that looks amazing. Good job, Konami, improving our NA collector rares. You love to see that. Second collector rare pull of the video, let's go. All right, feeling a little better. We've got half of our collector rares. Let's get the last two in here. We gotta believe. That was a really nice one too. I'm super happy about that. Card looked awesome. Like the background looks really good on that Archosaur. That is super sick. I love it. Those Look, Dino players out there, everybody, guess what? We're getting new pretty cards. It's amazing. All right, Giant Rex, we got supers there. Wild Survivors, let's go. Bless us with a burger, that is nice, okay. I mean, now we just need to pull the other, uh, let's pull UTC and Solidity Over Raptor as well. That'd be pretty amazing if we don't get the burger. I'd take those, another super. There's another Arc Sword, it's just the rare version. The low end version, we got the high end version, let's go. I don't even know how expensive it is. It says 99.98 right now, which it's gonna go down probably when it comes out, but a nice super. I mean, that's a pretty basic price, you know. He's, uh, that person has undercut someone who put 99.99. Another super, very nice. Can we get it? Can we get something epic? We have Vanquish Soul. I mean, that was a pretty epic pull. I'm happy about that one. Getting down pretty low though. We can see a lot. I mean, all the packs right here, you can see everything. We have, oh, a fossil dig! Another off-centered. What did they do with these collector rares? The centering is awful. Wow, but that is an amazing looking card as well. Look at that foil. Dinos, we are getting some nice looking cards. That is beautiful, Fossil Dig. I love that. I love that we're pulling the Dino Collector Rares. They're my favorites. Besides, of course, the burger, but that is some really nice looking stuff. So three of our Collector Rares looking incredible. Oh my goodness, that's awesome. We got another Ultra Rare. Wow, we're on fire right now. That was sick. Okay, so the looks like the centering on these are really bad for the most part. It's kind of weird. Um, I guess they didn't cut them too well. Even today, we have off-center problems. It's crazy. You thought that'd be an LOD, you know, Legacy of Darkness thing and be done. But uh, nope. Wild Survivors, we got a Vanquish Soul Trinity Burst. Very cool. One more Collector Rare and we're happy. Two more Collector Rares and we're freaking out. We're going crazy. We have another Super Rare right there. We're already kind of freaking out, so that's pretty nice. Yeah, I think it's going to end up being in the 40-something minute range. I thought I was, I was a little bit ahead of schedule in terms of how long it was but uh, I don't think so. Don't think I'm gonna beat it, I'm not gonna lie. Maybe it's because we hadn't pulled a collector where I hadn't spent, you know, 
time freaking out for a second, so now I've kind of caught up with those last two collector rares. One more, baby. Come on. We have a Vanquish Soul Caesar Vadius. Very nice Ultra. Down, okay, what are we probably down to? Maybe like 90 packs? Is that really that much? That's kind of a lot. Maybe like 80? I don't know. I can't tell how many are in these stacks, but it could be that much. We have a Vanquish... Oh, Lockhart. We have a la carte. Or no, not a la carte. Just Lockhart. No a la carte. Okay. Today's menu. Very nice. Okay, more menus. We want to pull more of those Hungry Burger field spell. Was it a field spell? I don't, I, yeah, I think it was a field spell. I can't remember if I checked, but I'm pretty sure rem I remember now seeing that. Wild Survivors long video. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, make sure to subscribe to the channel because if you didn't re you know, remember somehow from the last few three videos, me reminding you, you're almost at 200K. IOC first edition box opening upcoming. It's going to be insane. It's going to be awesome. We've never opened that box before. I've opened every other first edition box from the DM era and the GX era. So yeah, this will be a first time. I haven't opened all like the 36s and stuff like 24. I've opened at least like one of the first edition boxes between hobby and retail. Um, which, by the way, I have a video about hobby and retail if you're wondering what that is, because it seems like there's always people asking me about that. So I guess they're just new people hopping in. But uh, I do have a video about that. I should probably update because it's pretty old and I, it's pretty terrible quality. But it like the information is still good, though. Wild Survivors. Let's go. We have a incantation. Super rare right there. Looking good. Oh, a lot of packs left. We just need one more collector rare to be fully half, not happy, but fully uh, complete, I guess, with like our our numbers and our ratios and everything. Long video today. I've opened a lot of packs in this video, but tomorrow even more. So make sure to come hang out for the live stream tomorrow. It's going to start sometime in the afternoon, probably like 12 central to like one central sometime in around there afternoon, not night, obviously. So 12 p.m., not a.m. Somewhere around there, maybe maybe one. It depends on what I have to do. I've got a lot going on, but I'm going to try and get it so it, you know, we can watch during the day. And if it does go for like you know, several hours. It's not like at midnight by the time we finish, you know, stuff like that. Pretty excited about it though. Should be pretty fun opening all these packs. It always is doing those live streams. I'm sure you guys, or a lot of you guys I know, enjoy them. Come on, Burger. You're gonna be the last collector right here. Oh, the Overaptor! Let's go, Dino! Another off-center collector rare, but that thing looks incredible. Okay, check it out. Got a little bit of like a shatter foil pattern in the background. Oh my goodness. Okay, wait, one sec. Are all these off center? Okay, the border wasn't off center. This one's kind of off center. And then these two are way off center. But three dinos. I love that. Shout out to my dino pass playing it at Hartford. It was pretty awesome. That was actually the last time I played in a YCS. So I need to bring back the dinos and play them in the next one. But uh that was pretty fun hungry burger pretty cool dinos were uh that was kind of like i was playing a lot of master duel and dinos were popular in master duel so i was like i'm picking this up in irl play and i played it i think i won two matches or something did i win two maybe it was only one i can't remember I, no i think i did win two because the first time i played i won one match and then i think i might have had a forfeit or something no I, no, I just won one match and then the next time there's a ground xeno i had a forfeit and a win so it was like I won two, but really it was only one, but I did a little bit better. Uh, we have a Ground Zeno. Cool. Let's see what we get. We have a Vanquish Soul. Definitely got to take some pictures of these cards. These look really good. These Wild Survivors Collector Rares are bangers. I'm a big fan of them so far. The, uh, like the texture on them seems to be pretty nice. They seems like they've updated it, the foiling a little bit to make it look a little bit better. Giant Rex. We got the growl the giant rouser whatever he's called we are officially down to a few packs left. i mean a few is still like two boxes left i think but you know the it's low you know you can see like there's only a few of them in each stack but there are like you know eight or nine stacks more surviving more wild here we go let's pull something hungry burger very nice the burger is hungry what will he be eating is the question. His enemies, I guess. We have super rare. But I already said, he needs to prepare to be eaten. You know, my short. <laughs> if you guys watch that short, if you made it this far in the video, first of all, let me know that you made it this far and that you're a legend. Second of all, let me know if you watched that short with the Hungry Burger, which I thought was hilarious. I also put it on Instagram and TikTok and stuff, but very cool. Wild Survivors. I think the stacks on the right are a little bit taller. I should probably go back to them. No more ultras from this part. We pulled a lot of supers in a row. Let's see if we can turn that around. Nope. Not that time. Okay, this stack looks like it has like 12 packs in it for some reason. So we gotta we gotta work on that one. We got another super. This one has a little bit more too. Maybe I'm just maybe they're just thicker packs, you know. They're a little bit thicker. You know what I'm saying? All right. Wild Survivor. A lot of packs have been opened. Over almost 300 packs opened in this video. 
So it's been fun. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to let me know. Don't forget to subscribe because we have some epicness coming up, guys. You guys know the epicness is coming. 200K. Got a lot of cool stuff. If you miss Legacy Week, by the way, go check it out. Legacy Week, we got six straight videos opening Legacy Packs. It was like last week at this point. So go check that out. There's a playlist, Legacy Week 2.0. If you guys want to go watch that, there's also a 1.0 for when we did Legacy Week the original time. I also realized Legacy Week the first time, we didn't open LOB. So I must have been using those for something else, but I was like, interesting. I did all but LOB that time. So this time we did LOB. We finished that part off, you know. We actually did that and, you know, rounded out the total week. It was pretty epic. We have Transcendosaurus. Very cool. We're really down to the end. Now, I bet they all have like four or five packs left in these stacks. So I've, I've really, really gotten through a lot of packs here today. Wild Survivors. Will it be a wild ending with another collector rare? We have a, ooh, an at table ultra rare. That's a good one. So they're only our second one of those. So ultra rares, they can be pretty hard to pull. Even a case you might not get too many of them. You might not even get a play set, which is what it looks like for that one. I don't really know because there's so many uh, Vanquish Soul Ultras, like how many of each we got. The Borger is the only one I like recognize every time we get it. The others, I'm just like, ah, we could have pulled three of those, could have pulled zero. I can't remember. They're so similar. And there's so many different ones, like there's six. So you got to really keep them separate. Okay, down to the last few packs, guys. Will we get another Collector Rare? There's another Dr. Mad Love. Okay, Mad Love I remember as well. So I think we do have like four of that one. So we kind of have a lot of Mr. Mad Love over there. Doctor, I should say. Didn't mean to uh, discredit your, all your work in school, man. I'm sorry about that. Sorry about sorry about that, Mr. <laughs> no, I did it again. I'm sorry, Dr. Mad Love. I'm sorry to disrespect you. Your doctorate earns respect, okay? Got a super there. We're getting real low, guys. It's almost the end of this new video. We have a today's menu. Cool. Coming down, yeah, there, we're probably on like the last box and a half, last box, something like that. We're super low on packs here. It's gonna come down to the end. Will we pull a fifth collector rare? Which we have, I think we did that in, was it Maze? I can't remember. We have a Caesar Valius. That one, I'm not too sure how many of those we have. I think we pulled at least one. Come on. Giant Rex, we've got a Novalis. Will we pull it? Oh, another at table, that's a play set. Nice, we're pulling them at the end. Very, very nice. Play a little burgers. Anybody playing burgers in their locals or in their next YCS? When even is the next YCS? I feel like there like, isn't one for like a couple of months for some reason. Okay, guys, we are almost to the end of this marathon video. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. It's been fun. We got a soul raisin. Okay, raisin I remember too, because oatmeal raisin, huh? Anybody? Vanquish soul oatmeal raisin. I can't speak oatmeal. Oatmeal. Another ultra. Okay, these are like a little bit bent. Hopefully there's nothing bent in the pack. Hungry burger. Yeah, that would be a bad one to bend. That'd be really bad. Okay, we got one more pack in that. Okay. We're officially down to the very end, guys. It's coming up. It's coming up. Another Vanquish Soul Super. There's like one pack in most of these left. One pack. Also, since we're at the end of the video, hopefully you've been enjoying it. If you are still here, then you are someone who might be interested in Pokerux. I've been posting a lot on Pokerux recently. We've been doing a lot of streams for Pokerux. We've been doing a lot of really cool runs for Nuzlocke. So if you are interested in that, go check it out because we are almost monetized, like like 100 watch hours away, which sounds like a lot, but you need 4,000. So we're at 3,900 out of 4,000. We're like really, really close. So if you guys want to go support over there, if you're interested in Pokemon Nuzlocke, then hopefully this is the content you will like. So go check it out. And then if you have any constructive criticism, like, hey, I, I like it, but I think this would be even more fun or something like that or something else I could do better, go check it out over there as well. You guys, we've been having a lot of fun with that and uh, getting it monetized would be great. I'd love to make five cents a video, you know? It, it, would be, it would be exciting, even though it's not going to be like a huge step in terms of like moneymaker or anything like that. But it is the next step for the channel, so I'm excited for that. Yeah, and then of course this channel, 200k, coming up. If you guys have enjoyed this video so far, do not forget to subscribe. Here we go. I think we're on the last like nine or ten packs right here. Don't forget. Do not forget. It's going to be epic. For, like the, I was going to say 400k. That would be in like 2028 or something like that. It would be 400k. But uh, the 200k is going to be awesome. I'm super excited for it. Okay, here we go. Six packs left, let's go. Gotta believe. Super rare, very nice. Cool stuff, five packs left. Come on, give us that collector rare. Hungry Burger, let's go. That's a super rare dust devil, cool. Four packs to go, Wild Survivors open 284 packs so far, it's been good opening. Okay, just a super, not the droid we're looking for. 
Let's do this bent pack first. Last time it had a Hungry Burger Super. Will it have a Hungry Burger? No, not a Collector Rare. Not that time. Two packs left, guys. 286 packs into this case opening. It's been a lot of fun. It's been an epic opening. That's another Super. Will we end on a big pull here in the last pack? All right, guys. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Hopefully, we can end with an amazing pull right here. Let's do the pack trick. No Rux and Special, I believe. Incantation. Here we go. Let's get that Hungry Burger. Preparation of rights. Incantation. And a Vanquish Soul Dust Devil. So we were ending with a bunch of supers at the end, but we had a pretty nice case. I was worried about our collector rares, but we ended up getting them. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Daxer, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, Dizzy, Mycycle, America Deutzer, Supreme Sage 21, and then a tie show, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Mimic Gecko, and Thomas McClain. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.